guys, it's Connie, and welcome back to the second season of Witchcraftin'. I'm going to be subbing for Meg for a little bit. Um, it can be anywhere from a week to a couple weeks. We really don't know yet. Uh, for those that do not know, um, unfortunately, her father had had a heart attack, and he had to have a triple bypass surgery, and he is not doing so well, so she has been staying with him in the hospital. So I am just going to sub for her, and um, hopefully she will be back soon. Um, so for this <laughs> video, I have decided to make a pentacle, I don't even know what you would really call it. It can be a decoration, a wreath, um, kind of like a dream catcher, I guess. I don't, I don't really don't even know what you would call it. But, um... So, all you really need is just a uh, circular object. It can be made out of wood, um, grapevine, metal. I, I mean, you can even use um, wire and just make a circle out of it. So, that is what I did. And if I can get this to show, I'm so sorry about the lighting. It's late at night, and there's not a whole lot of light going up up here. Maybe that'll help a little bit. Um, anyways... You'll have to excuse the pentacle. Um, me and the black ribbon had a bit of a battle. <laughs> I was having a really hard time because this is the, um, like a copper, really slick, and this is a, like a really silky ribbon. So it was really hard to try to shape it into a uh, pentacle. So it's not the best, but you get the idea anyways, I hope. Um... So yeah, I just pretty much just took some ribbon and tied it around to make a pinnacle. And then I took some of this really wacky <laughs> yarn stuff. I don't know if it would even be yarn, but ribbon, yarn, whatever. And made it kind of dangly. And yes, Isis always has to be up in the videos. And I made them all different sizes and stuff. And I don't know if I can get this to show better. And it just goes up on your wall. Like so. And um, all it is with the ribbon is you can tie it on. But what I like to do so that way it's just kind of you can move it around a little bit is I will take it like so if I can get this to work <laughs> one hand it just don't work guys um, I just take it and fold it over and then I will cut it to the size I want and then I would just take it and fold it under and I don't know how I'm going to show you guys this give me one second and hopefully I can show you if Isis doesn't knock the, the, the camera over, the phone. Anyways, so I will just cut it to the size that I want. I'm just going to do a really, I don't know if you can see this or not. Uh, there we are. Just a really small piece. And then, I don't know if you guys can see. This is so hard. So anyways, I will just take it and put it around. I really hope you guys can see this. Okay, and then... Oh, that came right undone. I just take it underneath, like right here. So you'll see if you guys can see this. And then I take what's the part that's down here. And then I just kind of tie it like so that way it still moves around however you want it but it's not like completely tied on there and then if you don't want it on there you can easily just take it off um, you can also um, do beads on it or any kind of charms um, you can I mean it's pretty much endless however you decorate it. I haven't put charms on it yet, but I probably will. Um, I says hello. 
<laughs> um, but, you know, you can put some beads on it, some charms on it, um, any kind of, um, what are those things called? Oh, jeez, I just went totally out of my brain. Uh, fake flowers, you can even, you know, glue some around it. I mean, it really is endless, but this is the most simplest way of making one. And I really hope you guys can see that. I will um, post a picture of it up on the wall and put it at the end of this video. Hopefully, if my program will let me do it. So, yeah, that's just one simple, easy way of making a really cool decoration for your walls or for outside on your porch or, you know, on the wall in front of your altar. Um, yeah. So, anyways, um, I hope you all have a very blessed night, and I will see you again for my day on Friday. Talk to you guys later. Bye.